Hi there, welcome to the short video clip as to how to set one of these up for the angle of attack. So I'm actually doing this in real time, so if anything goes wrong, bear with me, we'll get it eventually. So this is the way the parafoil, it's the 2.2 metre parafoil I sell. This is the way it comes in this a wrap, polythene wrap. So to set up the angle of attack, all you need is four of these tie wraps, they're just ordinary tie wraps, you can use in the pound shop for a quid. Very cheap, so all you need four of these. A pair of scissors. So let's go. So we open the packet up. Take out the foil, put that to one side. So this is it as it comes in the package. So we just open up. So as you can see it looks a bit of a tangle as we open it up, but all the plumb clear hopefully. So what you do is you just take the, the lines like that. Now you'll see that we've got here, this is the, the rear of the foil, this is the front. So first thing to do is take the elastic band off where all the shrouds come together and the lines. And you'll see that there's one for each side. So we'll put that one down, we'll just do one side, the other one's exactly the same. So you can see that this is the brake line which is wrapped around that nylon cord. Just unravel that. We're not going to do anything to this brake line, that stays as it is. So we'll just put that to one side, put it down there. Here you can see at the back of the foil we've got the D line. This is the C, the B and the A. So what we want to do is we want to keep the D line that's the rear one, as it is. So what we need to do is take the four sets of lines like that, just bring this down, turn that round, and now we want to line these up. One, D, C, and B, like that. Just make sure that the hoops are slightly lined up like that. Take that like that. Get your tie wrap, bring that round, it's a bit tricky this but it's not too bad, just tighten that up, just make sure they're lined up properly, tighten that up, then snip it, get rid of that, don't need that, then we take the first line, that's the A, and line that up just with that tie wrap. And again we're going to tie this round. So take your second tie wrap, round like that. Just make sure it's lined up before finally tightening it. Tighten up, snip it. So there we have it. Now this loop, the lower loop here we don't use, this is the one you, you attach to your static line. So if we just turn that around again. That's as I will set, you'll see and that's it set up a proper angle of attack. Your D line at the back stays the same and the other three are stepped up like that. So that's one side done. The other side is exactly the same, so I'm going to do that just now and we'll get back to you in a wee second and show you the completed foil. On the other side, so that's the, the actual foil, power foil set up for the correct angle of attack. You can see that they're staggered, lines are staggered on both sides and the brake lines remain the same. So that's it I'm afraid, you can uh, do your own power foil from now on. As long as I set up like this, they'll fly away. Thanks for watching.